Friday last week on 7-12-2014, there is a monthly deal going on for the wonderful pistachios or selected snack items. Spend 15 get $5 up reward. And they were regular price at $5.99. I got it for $4. So I picked up four of them, which equals $16. I also have four fifty cents off of one manufacturer coupon, which made it three dollars and fifty cents each. I also had nine dollars worth of up reward to use. So this is how it looked like on the receipt here. And at the end I paid five dollars plus tax, which made it five dollars and thirty two cents. So I actually got it for a dollar and twenty-five cents per bag, and at the end, I did get back the five dollars in up reward. So it is still tracking that I spent a dollar. So I have to spend fourteen more dollars to get the five dollar in up reward for my next purchase. And also, I did lose four dollars worth of up reward, so I was fine with that. And Actually, it made it completely for free after I received the up reward. So I was really happy about that. And I also picked up for the Donnie Unstoppables. They are regular price at $7.99. And I, they were on sale last week for $5.49. So I picked up for them, which made it $21.96. I also had a $2 low two car coupon and three $2 off of one manufacturer coupon on any Donnie Unstoppable product. And so that's $8 worth of coupons. And I also came in and used a $9 and up reward. So this is how it will look like on the receipt here. Subtotal was four ninety six, and after tax was six fifty five. And last week, whenever you purchase twenty dollars worth of Procter and Gamble products, you get back seven dollars in up reward. And also, whenever you purchase two of the Donnie Unstoppables, you get back a one dollar in up reward. So it's a monthly deal, and I did get back those up reward at the end. So I did get. $9 back in up reward. So, um, it was a really awesome deal on that. And also, whenever you spend $30 worth of Procter & Gamble products, I believe it has to be from the household items that's being pictured, you will get back $10. So, I spent four ninety six, and I have to spend a little bit more to get to reach thirty dollars and in order to submit it in the mail. And on summer fourteen I also went to Rite Aid in the this trip and um I picked up the hometown apparel. It is the baby onesies. They are regular price at eight oh nine eight ninety nine rather and I got it for eight oh nine with my ten percent off discount. I could not find the teddy bears, they were all sold out, and I think that they were so 99 and um, it does make it even better deal whenever you have the gold or silver discount. So, yeah, they were all gone, and I don't know when they're going to get more in, and only a few Rite Aid stores, or the bigger Rite Aid stores in my area has this particular item. So... You buy one, you get back a $9 and up reward the is 8 And I've already gotten two, and I need six more to go, and I'm trying to go to Rite Aid again later on during the week to get more. So I will have to go to the ones that actually sell this particular item, because not all Rite Aid stores carry it. The Clean Touch Wet Wipes, they're a regular price for a dollar after silver discount kicked in, paid 90 cents. The Soft Baked Cookies, they were a regular price for a dollar, 
after 10% off discount made it 90 cents and there was a 50 cent off a of warm freshness pilly sticker which brought it down to 40 cents so this is how it looked like on the receipt here I did came in and used nine dollars in up reward subtotal was 39 cents and after tax was a dollar and three cents and I did got back the nine dollar and up reward for purchasing the hometown apparel so it does make it a money maker if you could find the lowest or the cheapest one as possible.